Hi, let's see how to fix Paradox Launcher not showing games. Are you a fan of Paradox interactive games but struggling to get the Paradox Launcher to show your games? If so, then you are not alone. Many gamers have encountered this issue and it can be really frustrating to troubleshoot. But worry not, we have got you covered. So without further ado, let's see how to fix Paradox Launcher not showing games. Solution 1. Open a support ticket with Paradox. If you are having issues with the Paradox Launcher not showing your games, opening a support ticket with Paradox is a good step. Here's how you can do it. Firstly, go to the Paradox support page. Then click on Submit a request in the top right corner of the page. After that, fill out the form with as much detail as possible and be sure to include information about your computer specs, the version of the Paradox launcher you are using, and any error messages you have received. Then attach any relevant screenshots or files that may help the support team understand the issue. After that, submit the support ticket and wait for a response from the Paradox team. By providing as much details as possible in your support ticket, you will help the Paradox team diagnose and fix the issue more quickly. Solution 2. Reinstall the Paradox Launcher If you are having trouble with the Paradox Launcher not showing your games, deleting the Paradox Launcher from the Programs and Features menu and then reinstalling it may do the trick. Here's how you can do it. Firstly, Press the Windows key and type Programs and Features in the search bar. Then click on Programs and Features to open the menu. After that, find the Paradox Launcher V2 in the list of installed programs and click on it. Then click Uninstall and follow the prompts to remove the launcher from your computer. Once the launcher has been uninstalled, Open the game you are trying to play. This should prompt the launcher to download and reinstall automatically. Once the launcher has been reinstalled, check to see if your games are now showing up. This fix has worked for many gamers who have encountered the same issues, so it's definitely worth a try if you are still having trouble with the Paradox Launcher. Solution 3. Check your antivirus software. If you are having trouble with the Paradox Launcher not showing your games, it's possible that your antivirus software is causing the issue. Here's how you can fix it. Open your antivirus software and check the virus chest or quarantine folder. Then look for the Paradox Launcher file and restore it to its original location. Then add the Paradox Launcher file to your antivirus software's exceptions list. This will prevent the software from flagging the launcher as a threat in the future. Restart your computer and try opening the Paradox Launcher again. This fix has worked for many gamers who have encountered the same issue, particularly with antivirus software like Avest. By restoring the Paradox Launcher file and adding it to your antivirus software's exception list, you can ensure that the launcher is not flashed as a threat and can run properly. Solution 4. Restart the Paradox Launcher and Steam if you are encountering an error where the Paradox Launcher crashes before it can even start due to missing files, deleting all Paradox games and programs 
and then reinstalling them on Steam may do the trick. Here's how you can do it. Simply uninstall all Paradox games and programs from your computer. Then open Steam and go to your library. After that, find the game you want to play and click install. Then follow the prompts to install the game and the Paradox launcher. Once the installation is complete, try opening the game and see if launcher is not showing your game. This fix has worked for many gamers who have encountered the same issue. So it's definitely worth a try if you are still having trouble with the Paradox launcher. Solution 5. Verify game files. If restarting doesn't work, then try verifying the game files. Simply right click on the game in your Steam library and select properties. Then select the local files tab and click verify integrity of game files. This will check for any missing or corrupted files and replace them if necessary. Solution 6. Run the game directly. If the Paradox Launcher still isn't showing your games, try running the game directly from the install folder. Navigate to the game's install folder and run the .exe file, not the dowser.exe. This will bypass the launcher and try to run the game directly. Solution 7. Check for compatibility issues. If you are using a non-Steam version of the game, such as the GOG version, it's possible that the Paradox launcher wasn't intended to work with that version. In this case, you can try running the game directly from the install folder or contacting the Paradox support for further assistance.